Basically, uh, I take something that's happened uh, in my life and um, I just try and write about it as uh, honestly as possible. <laughs> Music should be about conveying emotions and um, for it, it's a lot easier to for somebody to relate to a sad song and for somebody to, especially when it's when you're saying um, when I'm talking about uh, an experience that I've had somebody can like sort of relate to that and make that um, their own. Short, um, the title track from this EP, is, um, was written last year and it's about, um, it's, a, it's a vivid argument with a, with a, a girlfriend, um, the things obviously aren't going right and, uh, and it's, it's totally just, it's going, come on, we need, to, we need to sort this out. Everything that I do with music, although I do it for myself and although it's like sort of as we've been saying, like sort of just keeping a wee diary of um, the shit that I go through, <laughs> um, which is not always necessarily a good thing, because everyone knows about it. But as well as that, and you know, as well as the sort of childhood dream of um, playing at a big festival and, and everyone um, knowing that I'm a musician and good at it and, and enjoying my music, what I've always really wanted for music is for somebody to come away from with the lyrics and go, um, that that made me feel something. That made me, that uh, that sort of applied to me and to my life. And oh, you've done that. You really stupid questions people ask you sometimes. You can't answer unless you're in that situation at the time. Like, what would you do if you had to remove? Would you cut off your arms? Would you cut off your legs? Well, I don't know, cause I use both in equal proportions of mine. I use my arms to hold you close, my legs to walk by your side. So if it's all the same to you, I like to keep my body whole for the time being. Yeah. Rather go deaf, or would you give up your eyesight? Well, baby, you know if I was blind, I wouldn't be alright. Because I wouldn't get to see your eyes blend in low light. Or the pale, freckled skin on the carb of your spine. And you know I would miss out on just as much as I couldn't hear you say you love me, and you always 
How many of the mates have you got to play maracas? <laughs> oh, I think everybody's capable <laughs> of playing maracas. I don't know, like, my sister's pretty bad. <laughs> <laughs>